Hello once again YouTube and welcome back to The Domain. Our community is filled with so many exceptional artists of all different varieties, but someone has truly stood out to me and a lot of other people over the last year with just so much consistent growth and exceptional content. That is J Mac Paints, and I'm a personal friend of his on Xbox and other social medias as well, but he has truly been just creating some breathtaking pieces of work. When I found out he was sending two of his pieces to a prize winner who happened to be one of my friends in Ireland, I convinced him to send the package to me first so I could unbox it, just to show you guys quite the level he is working at. And he was kind enough to include these. Beautiful. So, J. Mac Paints, thanks for sending this over so I could review it and then forward it to Kellum, the winner of this prize. Kellum, Callum, Callum. J. Mac was nice enough to include two of these as well. And I believe, yeah, I checked last time, they're the same code. Not that I was going to choose the best one necessarily, but maybe I was going to have a bit of a say in what I opened. I don't know. They're the same code. And this is Infinite Series 5 Blind Bags. So, of course, before we unpack the greatness today, we may as well open an Infinite Series 5 Blind Bag. I've been really excited to get hold of one of these. Without further ado, let's tear right down the middle. It's a blue base plate, which is very nice. Interesting choice. I think all of them in this series are this uh, translucent blue. Which Spartan lays inside? And yes, the first ever all Spartan Blind Bag series. Here we go. <laughs> I thought it was. Look at that, the EOD, wow. So this is an EOD that's modeled after the EOD that appears in the Silver Team in the Halo TV series. It looks incredible. We've had new articulation EOD before, never quite like this. And this just makes me want a Silver Team even more. He comes with a commando rifle. We need Silver Team in uh, Halo Infinite as well. It just looks so good. I I'd imagine with the season two of the TV series coming up, we will get, you know, an actual Silver Team in Halo Infinite playable. Look at that, that is gorgeous. Very interesting metallic green as well. And let's have a quick look at the rarities here. So the Yoroi, yeah, I always want the AC to be the ultra rare. At any given moment, I only want one AC. So having that as the ultra rare is the best idea for me. Another member of Silver Team here. I think that's either Kai or Riz. And then the Master Chief has updated armor for Silver Team. We also have the Haunted Helmet, which is pretty cool to see it as an actual release. And then the Anubis in the Action Block armor coating, which has been, you know, synonymous with Halo Mega as you got it from buying the Warthog Rally back in the day. What J Mac has really set himself apart with is his incredible base plates. Look at that, that's awesome. So that's like molded clay. It's dried so nicely though, it's completely solid. Some nice little foliage, and you can buy foliage like this from any hobby craft store. Same with these little rocks, like any model train store, any like Warhammer kind of specialist store. They'll always have these kind of rocks and terrain pieces, and then you can get some clay and some sand. You can make some dope customs, right. We have two figures. We're gonna build up to the ODST because, you know, it's an ODST. First of all, we're gonna have a look at the Halo 3 Spartan. Oh yeah, baby. A new articulation Spartan Recon. So I think that's the original bronze visor that came with the Recon. It certainly looks like it might be. The helmet looks amazing. It looks quite similar to uh, Oni Specialist Dare's helmet, but these shoulders are great. There's a lovely backwash on those that seep into the cracks of the armor. It's just a nice glossy base suit. Uh, really what they've done well is the backwash. You can get watered down paint and it seeps into the cracks and it gives a more dirtied effect and uh, a nice little bit of black detailing there. This is just a nice figure. Like this Recon is really great. I imagine that this is like a bit of a bonus item because I think the star of the show is this ODST. Let's have a look. And yeah, definitely go follow J Mac Paints on Instagram. He's putting out so much stuff right now. This looks amazing. Wow. Very impressed with this. This is awesome. Also, my new macro lens. I, I literally wanted to wait until I had this macro lens so I could make this review because you've just got to get all that detail in. I love this custom visor. People like him and G Customs are the perfect people to show off LS3D's work because all of LS3D stuff is just 3D printed. It's not painted. Perfect fusion. Look at this. I, mm. oh, this is so dope. You know me, I love covert ops more than most things. And um, this is the perfect example of a nice covert ops figure. Look at that lovely tactic. 
tactical pad on the uh, the bootstrap there. In the future, uh, you know, I'm gonna do a much bigger JMac Customs showcase. And JMac, I know you'll be watching this. When you eventually send me, uh, you know, a large selection, you should include a list of everything that's 3D printed, so I can like really showcase everyone's work perfectly. Look at that. That's an actual mini diorama. Like that works so well, even just on its own. Amazing work. Just exceptional. Look at that. I love these rocks. I love the foliage. I love the clay. And yeah, it's especially nice how they add a little stud here so you can hop the foot right in and he's just gonna hold in place. It's like it's a mini diorama. That is so sick. Guys, the work of JMac paints and we are just getting started. JMac is one of the people joining us at the Halo Championship Series final in October. You can come find his work there or I mean you'll be able to see a lot more of his work when it's displayed at an even greater extent on my channel coming soon. I'm so impressed by this. This is seriously incredible. So JMac, big shout out to you and shout out to everyone that supports the channel. As always, you stay awesome, you stay safe out there, and the Halo 3 Recon is signing off.